episode seven of Maz TV. So first, we Maz up. Maz up. We have spring sale and spring Ooh. drops going on. And we also have an 88 point inspection quality that we just want to clarify for you guys. So quite a few things. Mm -hmm. This is why I wanted him to announce it. <laughs> and then after Maz up, we have Tech to Date. What's up for Tech to Date? For Tech to Date, we have news on 5G, the Galaxy Fold, Discless Xbox <laughs> One S, and we have news on China's new guidelines <laughs> for video games. Okay, for In My Shoes, which is the next segment, we have news about Tesla. So you guys want to listen to that. What's in the box? Today for what's in the box, we have the P30 and the P30 Pro. And then funny finds, of course, funny videos for you guys to watch and for us to enjoy as well. And, and Carla's favorite segment, buy a burn. All right, and so for Maz Up, on our website, we also have a big sale going on and big price drops. We have our spring sale for temporary sales and our spring drop for more permanent sale discounts. Mm -hmm. So head on over to our website. And just to let you guys know that our products go through 88 point quality inspection. A very rigorous inspection. So you guys could get good quality products from us. Alright, so for Tech Today, we have four topics of conversation. The first is 5G. Again, everyone's talking about 5G and we talked about 5G in the last episode. And it's going to be around for a while because it is the new tech. But more specifically, 5G has some limitations already. It's only really gonna work in highly dense urban areas. It doesn't seem like we'll ever be able to get it in rural areas because it has difficulty penetrating buildings and it needs to be within a relatively short distance. So it's unfortunate for those who are in less urban areas. So we'll see how that progresses in the future. Next, we have the Galaxy Fold. How unfortunate. Review copies have been breaking. People thought that the screen protector, well, it really wasn't a screen protector, it was the screen, have been getting broken devices so badly that they have all been recalled and the, del and the launch has been delayed. Wow. The quoted words were potential weeks. They probably should have dropped it sooner, before they announced it, before they gave people review products, but lesson learned, I guess. And next we have China censorship on, well, what happened recently was they finally released new guidelines because for a while there, I'm talking months, they didn't release or renew any new licenses for any video games in China, very strict. And they finally released new guidelines that include no images of blood, including slime or whatever green blood and enemy oh, alien. Have you heard of what they did to Game of Thrones? They censored everything um, sexual and every violence. Yep, that sounds like what China so they would do. People can't really watch it. It's so funny. People in China are complaining they can't watch it. And it seems like they're doing that with video games as well because you can't even show dead bodies. They just disappear. And on top of that, they've even banned Mahjong. Wow. What? Very cultural. I know. Yeah, the very cultural game from their own that you can no longer play. So that sucks. And oh, and it's also important because one of, or excuse me, the biggest video game publisher out there, Tencent, is in China, who now has to adhere to these rules and guidelines. And I wonder if they will push those out to the other game developers that they own throughout the world. I'd really rather they didn't. Yeah, really rather they didn't. <laughs> Lastly, it's the Xbox One S. All right, this one doesn't really make sense. It's more of a, it's more of a signal. It's more of a canary in the coal mine thing. They really want to switch to an all digital platform of releasing their video games because they just want to be able to make sure that they set the sale prices. You can already get a console, an Xbox One S, the same model with the disc tray, even cheaper than what they're selling it for new. So clearly it's not because they plan on making money on this. It's more because they're letting you know that probably in the next generation, we're not going to see a console with a disc tray. I think this is uh, I think this is the end for the disc. In my shoes. Now, for people that own Teslas, we've not got... Me. Not you, not me, not anyone. <laughs> but we've got great news. Elon Musk says... Hello, Elon Musk. You're such a fangirl. Elon Musk groupie. I want to go to outer space. Please take me with you. <laughs> 
Anyway, Elon Musk says that by 2020, people could start driving with their hands off the wheel. Is that even driving anymore? I know, what is that even called? But he says that this should be available in the next six months or next year, the latest. So six that's is super generous. That's so soon. And but the thing is, Elon Musk has a kind of a reputation of saying this is going to happen by this time, and it never really pushes through. It takes a little longer. But no, I, Two I get years it. Sounds more reasonable. Six yeah, months yeah. sounds like a lot. Yeah, how much you guys want to bet that you're still going to be holding on to your wheels by think, six months? I think people will still hold on to their wheels after it's self-driving. <laughs> Not everyone is, is ready for that. Well, there you go, guys. If you own a Tesla, great for you. If you don't, let's go cry in the corner. Okay. <laughs> What's in the box time? Today we have the P30 Ooh. and the P30, P30 Pro. Pro. I'm sorry, was I too hard? Okay. <laughs> let's do let's start with the P30. You can't tell me not These to do something and then you heavy. do it. Okay. Really? Um, heavy? We'll do P30? Yes. Okay, here we go. Let's talk about what's in the box. Ooh, it's cardboard. Look at that, eco-friendly. Oh, recycled. I think that's recycled material. It I would should hope. be. Yeah, because usually it's plastic. Yes. Like I remember iPhone, this part is plastic. So hopefully it is. Phone case and SIM tool. Uh-huh. Start that over there. And then power brick. With the uh, with the uh, movable bit. Yeah, it's like oh, adjustable. So you can make it more compact. And <laughs> sorry about that. <laughs> Just a note, the power brick is kind of heavy though. Um, and then 30. this one? Charger. Yeah, what is that one? Mm, a wire. <laughs> no, it's a charger and the earphones that look very similar to Apple earphones. I like Huawei's phones, but I'm not going to lie. They like to borrow yeah. from other people. <laughs> okay. And here is just a quick little view of the phone. We're going to do some stuff with it later. Mm -hmm. Just a quick little view, though. Cute. All right. Let's Next move on up. to the Pro. Okay, the boxes are the same size. I noticed that. Yeah. Can we do a quick side by side and see if the phones are the same size? No, the P30 Pro is Much slightly, bigger. slightly bigger. Oh, okay, slightly. Yeah, slightly okay. bigger. Now again, let's do a quick little. Here's the front side. Cute, cute. And then all this beautiful blue color. Hmm? Mm -hmm. We're gonna, actually, what we're gonna do is. Blue and purple. It's a gradient. It's, yeah, it's a gradient. What we're gonna do is we're going to play rock, paper, scissors, and we're going to see who's going to review the P30 and the P30 Pro. Okay, so whoever wins gets the... Pro. Pro, okay. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot! <laughs> it's rock, paper, scissors, shoot! When's the last time you played this game? A long time ago. Okay, rock, paper, scissors... <laughs> rock, rock, paper, scissors... All right, come on. I'm not going to look, I'm not going to look. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Okay, shoot. Oh my god, shoot. <laughs> scissors, shoot. Yay, I get the pro. Finally. You weren't watching. I wasn't playing. I was just looking at you, waiting for you, you to go. Like... <laughs> and I still lost. <laughs> Carla wins. I'm fine with it. She gets the pro. I'm going to review the P30. So let's get to doing some outside stuff. Let's go. The device is powered by octa-core processor paired with 8 gigabytes of RAM. As far as the battery is concerned, it has 4,200 milliamp hours. Over that, as far as the rear camera is concerned, this mobile has 40 megapixels, 20 megapixels, and 8 megapixels. Now let's test this camera out. So this is our subject, James. He's not the best subject, but he will do. And now we're zooming in. This is crazy, guys. Look at this. This is only at 30 times zoom. The thing is you have to keep a very steady hand when taking a photo. And that's at 50 times zoom. And this is how far James really is. That is crazy. And we also have the pro option where we have the ISO, the shutter speed, the exposure, and the autofocus. So we can use this if you want to use a professional camera, I guess. But for amateurs like me, I use the normal kind, the normal camera. And this is portrait mode, which focuses on his face.
because um, it detects it detects the face that's there. So when you zoom in, the face will still be focused. We also have the night mode. We'll try that out later though. And there's more options as well. So we have all of these options. There's also an underwater option, which I wish we could test that out. That seems really cool. And we have time lapse and a sticker also. Let's test out the sticker. Oh, there it is. So we can zoom in as well with the sticker on there and we'll take a photo. And there we have it, a photo with a sticker at the side. That's pretty cool. And that's the P30 Pro. Uh, first of all, disclaimer guys, you're gonna see some black bars reflecting on the camera, but that's actually not the screen. Uh, this was used recording the Huawei P30 Pro. So that's just something going on with the camera, but nothing actually to do with the phone itself. So don't worry about that. So here we have the P30. And as you can see, we have the teardrop notch at the top and it's running Android uh, Pi with EMUI 9.1, uh, Huawei's um, skin on Android. The P30 uh, releases at 699 euros. For that, you're gonna get 128 gigs storage and six gigs RAM. The P30 is waterproofing or water resistant at IP53. The display is 6.1 inches OLED and it's 2340 by 1080 resolution at 19.5 by 9 uh, aspect ratio. It's got a triple rear camera with three times optical zoom and it has up to 30 artificial zoom. It, the P30 is also running the Kirin 980 GPU and it has 36, 3,650 milliamp hour battery. And here's the camera part. Okay, here's wide, here's one time, here's three time, here's five time, and lastly, up to 30 artificial zoom. That is insanely strong. And there's Carla. <laughs> okay, there's portrait photo, video, pro, with all your different options for more control, more, slow-mo, panorama, panorama, monochrome, AR lens, light painting, HDR, a lot of options here. And you have a few more for download. Okay, okay, so first of all, we have the P30 and the P30 Pro, but this is, this first shot here is night mode. Night mode on both. Yeah. Um, I could see that on the P30 Pro, it looks like crisper. It's, you know, yeah. Like it's it, sharper, the photo. The colors are a bit different though. I'm a little more warm on the P30 and the yeah. P30 Pro, I'm a little more cool there. Like it's taking color out of yeah. my skin. I can <laughs> say that I prefer the photo of the P30 because the other one is too sharp. Yeah, the Pro is a little, doing a little too much there. Yeah. And then here's normal. Um, even in, even without there's night There's not a huge difference, I'd say. Yeah, but in comparison between the two, no. But I will yeah. say again, the P30 Pro is a little darker for some reason, and the and the P30 yeah. is a little um, like it's it's the contrast is higher. Yeah, does that make sense? Yeah, they're putting too much contrast in the colors on the P30. The yeah. Pro, the P30 looks good though, nice and clear. Yeah. This and is... here we have the Lego model with uh, same P30 and the P30 Pro in night mode. Whoa! Why does the P30 look better than the Pro? The the Pro seems to be putting in a lot of extra work. But it just gave yeah. everything a red tint. I'm not a fan of that. Yeah, like compared to the P30. Yeah, like don't get me wrong, we have red lighting in the background, but the thing is the P30 regular just didn't add all that redness to yeah. it. Yeah. Can we look at the regular photo? Yeah, and then here's the regular. And again, oh. the, the Pro is really even added yeah. more red. Yeah, I prefer the P30, which is crazy, because yeah. the Pro should be better. You would think. Yeah. <laughs> you would think. If you guys can explain this in the comments below as to why the P30 Pro does this, I don't know, maybe it has a better explanation to it or... I feel like what's going on is something in the um, software. Yes, something. For I don't some know. reason it decided to go with the red, but I gotta say, I prefer yeah. the, the rawness In person of... though, our lighting is a little more red. Yeah, it is, but the P30 didn't pick it up. No, the, the P30 Pro did not went pick intensely that up. on that red. Yeah, there is, okay, we'll tell you guys that our lighting does have slight red tint to it, but um, they both either picked it up too much or didn't pick it up at all. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so the lighting behind the toy, 
Um, it does have a slight um, red tint to it. And you can see it with the reflection on the wall, that's where the lighting is. But um, yeah, like we said, the P30 Pro took the red tint a little too much and the P30 didn't take it at all. So and I prefer really both these photos. I'm like in the P30 and night mode. Yeah, same. I'm going for the P32. Like for the night P30 mode. The P30P is a little too much. Yeah. For night mode, yes. But when it comes to zoom ins and stuff, P30 Pro is still a win for me. And that's the P30 and the P30 Pro. Let us know in the comments below which one you guys prefer. Time for some funny fun. Woohoo! What's, what's going on here? She's eating an onion. No. Look at her face. She's ah. loving that. She's like, eh. She's like, can I have an apple? It's I just an love onion. the. I just love that the the parent isn't like actually taking it away. Just like, oh, all right, you're gonna enjoy that. Did you know that they say if you eat an apple, I mean, eat an onion without smelling it, it tastes like an apple? I tested. I, I tested that. it out. It's not true. I, I had the same reaction as this would baby. You? Look at her. Oh no! Why is she still eating it? I mean, that's a good onion. <laughs> She's like, no, mom, I'm right. This is an apple. <laughs> She's really going, oh, oh, really going to town on it. Okay. Oh no. Look, he's a good boy. That's ASMR. Really? Of a dog. This is this is what it's come uh, to. Do you do, do you like ASMR? No. I love ASMR. So this is uh, probably the only ASMR you would watch. It, Oh, it's cute. just so uncomfortable. It's so cute. What do you mean? I don't. I mean, why can't you support his dreams? Is this his dreams? Did he yes. choose to do this? Eating food, Look, eating an apple, like the good boy he is. At least, at Aww. least he's eating healthy. True. I didn't know dogs could eat that. To be honest. <gasps> now for some hydration. Uh, some people think this is calming. Do you, do you no. Like no. Who, who is some people? Oh, you're such a hater, James. Sure. <laughs> Look how cute that dog is. I mean, yes, the dog is cute. The video is weird. No, it's not. <laughs> so Tiger Woods is coming he out. Is. All right. What's he see? What's he see? What? Uh, oh. That's no. his arrest image. That's so embarrassing. But hey, at least he smiled, you know? <laughs> yeah, he can take yeah, a joke. Yeah, well, he's good sport. <laughs> Another animal. What is this? What's hiding here? Is that a, is that a lemur? Yeah, let's get him out again. Uh, Boom. Uh, who just started? So cute. And that was our funny finds videos. I hope you guys enjoyed it as much as we did. For buy or burn. burn. So first up, 5G. Ah, uh, burn. Burn. It's not there yet. Same. How about discless Xbox One? Try burn. Burn. I still like having the option. Same. Burn too. We're burning a lot. We're burning a lot of things today. And next is the Galaxy Fold. Burn. I would say buy originally, but now that it's gone through some issues, issues it's <laughs> a burn for me. I wish I could have said buy too, but no, it's a burn. Oh no, everything's on fire. What's next? All right, and last option: the P30 or the P30 Pro. Uh, P30 Pro buy. P30. I'm the opposite with that one, hmm. just because the P30 is just a little bit cheaper. That's really it. Ah, I mean, they're both okay. they're both great quality phones. Yeah, I was going for the better camera. That's, that's no, why. that is that is. That is but either true. way, I can't afford both. So <laughs> yeah, there you go. <laughs> <laughs> All right, that is the end of episode seven of Maz TV, and good luck to you with the giveaways mm -hmm. for the new phones and the Apple Watch. Go ahead and join, guys, because you don't get to get a free phone or a free gadget every week. Except here, really, really, <laughs> yeah. so many. And so with that, I hope you enjoyed it. Mm -hmm. If you guys like this episode, please give it a thumbs up. Also, subscribe to our YouTube channel, follow and like our social media pages, and check out our website as well. I'm Carla. And I'm James. Thank you guys so much for watching. See you.